Matt Panto back here on GoLeopards.com. Some good signs of spring. The sun is out, and men's lacrosse season is here and ready to go. And we sit down with the first-year head coach of the Leopards, Jim Rogowski. And Jim, for the last time now, you've had a couple months, and a lot of months actually, to get acclimated to Lafayette. Coming into the job and now spending almost close to maybe eight, nine months here, your overall impressions of Lafayette and uh, what you expected? Things have been fantastic. One of the first things we, we did was put together a great staff. That was the first staff we got with some guys, two guys, Ed Williams and Matt Musi, have done a fantastic job. Uh, we're on track with the recruiting, the, the team in the fall. We really focused on getting in the weight room, preparing ourselves to compete in the spring. We've done a great job of that. And then coming back here in the spring, starting practice a couple weeks ago, you know, it's really focused on our first game, which is coming up on Saturday. So we like where we're at. And, you know, it's, it's just been the guys have been great. They've listened to us. They've worked hard. Just a real testament to that type of individuals in the program. Great senior, senior leadership, great captains. You know, we're excited for Saturday. You get through fall ball and now you transition into the spring. First off, first and foremost, what were the goals transitioning from fall ball tactically into the spring? What did you want to see more of? The lacrosse has changed now with new rules. And what's happened is the pace of play has, has, has come much faster. Uh, the way you run midfield is a little bit different where guys need to now be conscious of offense and defense. We're able to run some more transition. So the first thing that we did really is get adjusted to the new roles in the fall, uh, really focus on pushing the ball, transition, creating some, some opportunities, teaching guys that traditionally don't usually play defense to now play defense, and you know all of which is going to be great for the game. I, I still think that... Um, programs and teams are still trying to figure out, you know, how these new roles are going to play out, and um, it was kind of evident in the first two scrimmages. But you know, I, I think it's going to be exciting. I think it's an exciting time for lacrosse, and I really think that, you know, that's, the rules are going to be great for the game. So we're we're excited to, to get into a game situation. Just to, you know, it's just different than scrimmages and different than practices, and, and you know, that's that's what we prepared for, and that's what we worked hard in the fall and in the preseason, and you know, we're we're ready to go here on Saturday. Take me into your practice schedule, transitioning then from fall ball to spring and spring into your scrimmages. What did you see in the scrimmages? And now moving forward, what's been the, really the main focus this week in honing in and getting ready for Georgetown? One of our major, major point of emphasis is the faceoff. Uh, we were under 50% last year, and, and I think that's something that we've really been focused on. And not just individual faceoff play, but the play of the wings. And, you know, winning the draws, but not losing the ground balls. And so we focused on that. And that's one thing that we did from the first scrimmage to the second scrimmage. And I thought we did a good job. We still are working progress we have to continue to, to work on that defensively uh, in our first scrimmage I thought we were we were we struggled a little bit uh, with communication and just you know playing faster we really focused hard on that and I think there was a huge improvement from one week to the next and hopefully if we can see that type of improvement um, f you know f into this week I, I think we're gonna, we're gonna be prepared for Georgetown offensively it's just you know getting guys together we got some guys off injuries coming back um, getting those guys some experience, some game readiness, some full speed. You know, they just in practice, you know, it, it, you got to play game speed. And so, if you, you know, the one thing that we've done in the last couple of weeks is just amp up our game speed to be prepared for that first whistle on Saturday. First whistle comes on Saturday at Georgetown. Always a great program, a great lacrosse program. First game, you always kind of, for lack of a better term, muck it up. Um, it can be sloppy at times for both squads. Your view going into Georgetown and your message to the team going into Georgetown. Yeah, I think it's it's early. You know, this is the first go for both of us. I think it's going to be sloppy, and I think, you know, mentally we have to be prepared for that. If we make a mistake, we can't we can't let it harbor in our mind. We have to move on and make the next play. So we've we've talked to the guys about you know being ready for that. Lacrosse is a game of runs. They're going to go on some runs. We're going to go on some runs. We have to be prepared, and you know we just can't let things get under our skin. We have to have short-term memory, and we have to make the next play. So we've really talked about you know that with the team. The other crazy part about this these. Early early season games is, you know, who knows what they're going to do. We're both new coaches uh, to new programs. You know, they, they have no idea what we're going to do. We don't know what they're going to do. So it's, it's going to be somewhat exciting in that respect to see, uh, you know, what it's all about. But that just means that we have to be ready for making adjustments during the game. And so we've talked to the guys that, you know, you got to think on your feet. You got to listen in the huddles. You got to pay attention to the adjustments that we make. And, you know, we just have to, while we're playing hard and, and keep getting after ground balls and such. And so, you know, I, I think the guys are ready for that. And that's what we've been really focused on in practice. I'm going to bring it up only because you've brought it up in previous interviews interviews I know you like the dependability of your senior class and everything that they've showed so far how much will you lean on them as Saturday as well yeah they're fantastic you know the, these are the guys that are battle tested these are the guys that this isn't their first go around this is their fourth preseason opener and with with some younger guys playing you know we're really gonna gonna lean on those guys hard just to keep us mentally even keeled and prepared and ready for anything that that we see speak for a lot of people saying we're looking forward to Saturday go get them down there thank you Matt Panto here with the head men's lacrosse coach, Jim McGrowski. Full recap, Saturday afternoon following the game on GoLeopards.com.